So how do you minimize the risk of an EDD audit of your company? If you hire independent contractors, EDD can review those workers and determine whether they are properly classified, and if not, they can reclassify them as employees. If you hire contractors, pay attention to this video. We have some very important facts for you. The first thing is you'll need to determine whether your contractors have an independent business. Do they have an EIN number, a business address, a business website? Do they have a business entity such as an LLC or corporation? And also, do they have other customers that they provide services to other than your company? These are some important facts to pay attention to. The second thing is the scope of work that the, the scope of work that the contractor provides to your company should be different than the services your company provides to its employees. So if you have, for instance, a residential plumbing company and you're hiring a commercial independent plumber, independent contractor or plumber, in a sense, you might be able to argue that those uh, services provided by the contractor are different than what you provide to your customers and that you're hiring a contractor for their specific skill, which is outside of your company's expertise. The third, although subjective standard, is the amount of control you have over your workers. Do you require your workers to have a name badge with your company's name on it or, and business cards with your company's name? Does the worker have to show up at a specific time? And do you review your contractor's work? Also, how often do you pay your contractors? Is it the same time you pay your, pay your employees or is it sporadic when the contractor provides an invoice? And lastly, do you have an independent contractor agreement with your contractor? Now, this doesn't you know, guarantee that you're gonna have an independent contractor classification that's uh, agreed to by EDD, but it certainly will help. We recommend hiring a tax attorney to review your records and the facts and also the change in the law. This will help ensure that you're in compliance. For instance, in California, January 1st, 2020, California law changed and AB5 now requires three elements. The companies have to satisfy three elements to ensure that their workers are properly classified as contractors. I'm John Milikowski, founder of Milikowski Tax Law. We hope this information was useful. We keep businesses in business.